Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Solana daily update, but we are going to see mid long term price targets. OK, what it is going to be by the end of the year, a speculation there. And of course, this is not something you should take as a financial advice. Before we begin, join our monthly subscription. I have the link in the description down below. Buy me a coffee slash Mind Your Crypto. You will get an automated system with buying and selling opportunities, a manual system with buying and selling opportunities. You will know exactly when to buy and exactly when to sell your altcoins you will also get educational videos personal guidance market updates and many many more benefits you can cancel anytime you like also join our telegram group chat and hit the like button subscribe help so much with the daily updates thank you thank you let's proceed quickly into the technical analysis and of course the price prediction technical analysis something different with how much the altcoin should worth i know solana is a great project but sometimes during this whole impulsive wave we just need to correct a little bit till we go into the next target far above the 262 okay but first of all we have made according to the Elliot's impulsive wave theory one two three you can see around 261 if we take our fibonacci extension starting from the low 21st december 2020 ending up to the top 17 may and ending up to the bottom we found on 17 may as well we should be seeing that we have this impulsive wave right here and the fibonacci extension tool and the fibonacci extension is helping us on identifying some important levels you can see that we have the 226 262 and we are having another correction that will be going off i do not know in where maybe 110 maybe 100 tether usd we will see about that do not know the exact correction that it will happen but we will have for sure a correction and of course right there we might be getting upwards let's say that we stop at the 262 okay let's say that we stop 262 before we go down uh, uh, okay, so I will draw a Fibonacci retracement from this here to here. Okay, and you can see that we have some major support levels going on. The first one is at 140. We have one more at the 100. And 11 okay so maybe maybe we stop at the 111 we will be seeing about that uh, and then go upwards again above way above the 262 let's see a little bit the Solana Bitcoin chart before we go into the risk metrics and you can see that we have on Solana Bitcoin chart uh, a little bit of a next price targets the zero point for 2053 and the 0.2062 you can see right there for Solana that we might be approaching there and let's say that by the time we approach this uh, Bitcoin will be 50k then Solana if we can approach this target then Solana can be around 310 tether USD so this is 310 okay 310 USDT all right so therefore if it is 50k then it's around there and you can do the uh, equation right there and you can multiply any number you like by the time we reach there maybe by the time we reach there bitcoin will be 40k or maybe by the time we reach there bitcoin will be 60k but it is very possible that we it is around 44 to 45k so a little bit less than the 300 tether usd by the time we arrive here and maybe maybe at 262 for solana on the weekly frame okay so this is something that we might consider going okay so because we need to see if we have any risk we will go to the risk metrics you can see now that we are in an extreme overbought situation and you should be careful because this is something that we might be approaching the 262 might not and we might correct a little bit sooner for example we might correct at this target the 226 so these three might go a little bit further down okay so we will have for sure a correction okay so we will have for sure a correction and we want to see when we are correcting okay because right now we are having an extreme overbought situation you can look all the three indexes okay you can look the stochastic RSI, you can look the RSI, and you can look the commodity channel index as well, which is in a great, great risk right there. Okay, and you will see that we have an extreme 
overbought situation we might be going up for like one two three maybe four weeks for more but keep in mind that we are having a very very critical uh overbought situation right here and it isn't necessary that we stop on the same place we might stop a little bit further down and correct or we might stop a little bit further upwards okay further up than it is if we stop further upwards then it is very possible to go to the 262 and from there we correct we may be correct and then go up again into the five which will be way way higher than the 262 and you can see that for the solana against bitcoin it is the same it is absolutely going insane and we want to see how much can we go upwards can we go into the 0 0.053 can we go into the 0 0.2062 the point here is that i think we can but can we correct before we go there maybe okay we have a very high risk on solana bitcoin chart too you can see the charts right there we are having an extreme risk and i believe this higher low pattern will keep going okay if we go down i believe maybe we stop around there and go upwards again but then we will have just a correction that we need to be careful about nothing important as a project solana is very very good and it is great and this is something that we should be seeing i believe in the mid long term it can go over the 500 tether usd it can go even even at the 500 why not over the 500 tether usd for solana okay so this is a possibility that might happen it won't necessarily happen and we are discussing right here okay so we are having very very high risk we can go even higher and expect a correction at the third point around there expect a correction and then we go back up again on the weekly frame thank you for watching have a fantastic day wherever you are do not forget to join the monthly subscription you will take easy profits and of course see you soon with many many more videos bye